gentlemen, welcome back to Souter Motors. Jay Lap with you today. I have got a travel trailer toy hauler for you. We have got a 2014 Keystone Raptor 31DS. This guy uh, has got two slides. It's got the garage in the back. We got a power awning. We got a generator. We got all kinds of stuff to show you. We are going to open it up. We're going to show you the outside, then we're going to show you the inside. So, let's get to it. Got it opened up here under the power awning. Got some good outdoor space. Uh, nice long awning here. Uh, we do have four new tires on this bad boy. Uh, nice aluminum wheels, keeping the weight down where we can. Got hookups here for TV, uh, if you like for the outside. Um, nice laminated sides on this guy, no D-lamb. So loud. Uh, this is a wardrobe slide, which we will see in a bit. I uh, got some uh, storage up front here, not pass through because the other side has the generator, but lots of storage space here, so loud. Up front, got our tanks, got our power tongue jack. It's going to get a little bit loud, but we have the generator running because it's got a generator and we wanted to show you that it runs. 4,000 watt generator right there. Outdoor shower, hookups. This is our living room slide. Here is your toy hauler fuel, which also the tank also runs the generator, which you are hearing there. And here we have our garage area slash guest bedroom slash um, dining area as well. Um, as you the bunks are down when you open it up you do have a nine foot uh sorry ten foot garage space uh the ramp is spring loaded so it is an assist down easy up and down come on over here you got your back entrance again nice power awning good outdoor space and now we're gonna go inside opened up very nicely by this big slide that we have here um, we've got the kitchen area let's just do this in here while we're here kitchen space added countertop space always nice to have for prep uh, we've got the nice solid drawers with the metal runners double sink oven stove combination three burner on top oven got our microwave up here um, our fridge and freezer combo, it is a Norcold. It can be uh, gas or electric, and it does have the automatic setting. We've got nice high ceilings in here because of the toy hauler. Uh, so lots of head space, nice open feel, especially with this big sofa that we have right here. You do have storage underneath, um, but nice comfortable sofa, good living space, entertainment on this side. Again, good storage, indoor storage, plus you've got the whole garage in the back. Um, got our CD player radio all that jazz here are your controls um, fuel gauge uh, tank readers slide and awning uh, this generator has 38.4 hours on it so still got a lot of life left in that guy thermostats right here as we move to the front got a nice queen bed got overhead storage um, got a sliding door for saving space. We've got the TV hookups over there. Um, but good space here. Ducted air conditioning um, in this section. 
Um, so, a lot of space in the bathroom. I've um, got the tub shower combo with the with the slanted roof up there. It gives you plenty of head space. Got the power vent. Got the medicine cabinet. A little bit of storage underneath the pedestal sink there. Uh, and then you got the toilet obviously. Power fan, power vent. That is the living space. And now for toy haulers. This space is insulated. Garage space is not. You don't really want to trap fumes where you're staying. So this part is not insulated, but you do have ducted air conditioning out here. Uh, you do have a power vent, which will move some air for you as well. Uh, TV stand over here um, with the hookups, all of that there. A set stand, it's not a stand, it's a mount. You understand what I'm saying. Um, and they did think here for the bunk people that you've got an um, elevated outlet. Uh, you do have vents, four vents on this guy uh, for when you are um, transporting. You want to obviously be able to not trap the fumes in here so the vents can open. Uh, these here pins, right here, they can be placed in here while these guys are up, which will keep your top bunk elevated so that you can utilize this beautiful sitting area here. And you can place this here portable table right in the middle there and make it a dinette section. For sleeping, you can just roll these guys over, obviously put the legs down. And then you've got another bed. So you've got bunk beds. Or, obviously, when storing and um, when transporting your toys, both of these go up by this little control right here. It takes a little bit of time, so we're not gonna do that, but just so you know, it does work. Um, you got the blackouts for the shades, um, so you can um, have sleeping in here, and there's tie downs in the corner. And we do have a ladder right here for our bunk. So that is about it. That is our toy haul. It is a 2014 Keystone Raptor 31DS. Any questions, please give us a call at Sauter Motors. Again, thank you so much for watching. Have yourselves a fantastic day.